fishing super slow. Just keeping it right above the bottom. Got him that time. All right, everyone, I'm heading to the first spot right now. I think I know where the big perch are gonna be. I'm searching for a waypoint I've got marked on the sonar here. Um, they're usually here. The thing today is that it's just above freezing and I'm gonna probably have to mess with some tactics to see if I can get one to bite. So I don't know if they're gonna be super active. I've got a friend in Holland right now and they're super active there, so who knows? Maybe they'll, uh, maybe they'll surprise me, but Heading out to this waypoint, when I get there, I'm gonna turn this bad boy on, start casting, and see what happens. I got my Nordman CF-13 Old Faithful. This kayak has not let me down. I rode it hard all last year, and I'm gonna do a review of this kayak for you guys really soon, so let's get to the spot. So one small, lethargic little bump so far. Oop. See, there are fish moving around, that's for sure. I've got ice in my guides. <laughs> it's that cold out here. Cast around in here for just a few more minutes and then I'm gonna move around and hit the farther side of this weed bed. Wind is picking up just a little bit as it usually does when the sun comes up. Oh! I just had a hit. They're super slow on the hit though. That was a perch too. They're super slow. I got a fish lower. Goodness gracious. As cold as it is, I can't afford to waste bites like that. Man. Dang it. Super, super slow. It wasn't a very hard hit at all, but it had some weight to it. I can tell that. Still there? It's a good sign. I think I will stay here for a little longer in this spot. That's the second bump. Oh. They're barely barely taking it. Let's see if he's still there. I'm fishing I'm fishing super slow. Just keeping it right above the bottom. Got him that time. Oh that's a good perch. That is a sweet perch. Ladies and gentlemen, that is a fat, beautiful perch. Man, you guys are gonna like this. This is sweet. This is very likely my personal best perch. I think I may have just hit 46. This is a big perch. Let me show you this. Look at this perch, guys. That is a freaking giant. 
This is a giant perch. Look at the belly on this thing. Look at this. That is, without a doubt, my PB perch. So we need to get a measurement on this guy. I'm super freaking happy right now. That is, that is more than I expected. And he stayed there time and time again as I threw that bait back in. I did not expect him to still be there, but he was. You know, I've got friends and family who ask me, why do you get up so early? Look at this. Look at how beautiful this is. I mean, come on. This is why. It's beautiful out here and I'm fishing. Perfect. All right, so you guys, that was a 43 centimeter fat perch and I am super happy with that. So that ties my, my PB. It actually didn't break it, but it was really close. So we're gonna keep casting and see what happens. If I can get my glove, the fingers out of my glove, they kind of retract it in there like a turtle. And they're wet. That was awesome. That perch, he hit three times and every time it was just super, ugh, now my gloves are really wet. And every time he hit, it was just a super slow, non-aggressive but that last time he nailed it get back at it it's a spot where the there's a lot of really thick weed that runs right up to a little shelf and the pike like to hide in that stuff and tear the bait fish up so the perch usually aren't far behind yeah i can already see pike hunting over there i think it was a pike anyway I just see the swell. I don't see the, didn't see the actual attack, but here we go. We've got the weed right out there. Just show you guys. So that stuff right there, there's usually pikes stacked up in there. It's right over there. And usually not far behind our perch fish oh he came off he came off i don't know if that was a perch or a pike i couldn't tell it's a good strike though good strike no teeth marks that must have been a perch it's a good strike too man he nailed it i just realized i had you guys pointed straight down at the water so you didn't even get to see that strike Hope this fish is still here. Cause he really killed it. Got him that time. Man, it's almost, I think this might be a pike. Whatever this is, is heavy. If this is a perch, this is ridiculous. I don't feel any drag marks from teeth on my leader at all. Uh, now I did. Yep, that's a pike little pike and that is look at this guys he completely he inhaled it so fully that he sucked it all the way through his gills look at that that is crazy I was able to pull it all the way back out of his mouth he wasn't even hooked he just sucked it right through his gills Let go. All right, we got about an hour left. We got that one tank, so mission accomplished, but it would be really cool to get another one or two. So that's what we're doing. We're gonna see if we can get on this other spot over here and try to get another tank.
Ooh, there was a hit right there. Had a fish, don't know what it was. Whatever it was, it was small and likely gone. Fish, don't know what it is. Oh, it's a pike, definitely. If this is, if this is a perch, it's huge, but I don't think so. Nope, this has got to be a pike. This could be a decent pike too. Hard to tell on this rod. This fish is, oh yeah, he's got some weight. This is a fish here. It is, and I only have fluoro on here. He's about to come up. Oh, this is a good, this is a decent pike. Not what I wanted. And what would be amazing if this was a Wells catfish. Looks like a pike. Yep, oh, a good one too. Good pike. Got some battle scars on him. Not what we're after, but look at that healthy fish. It's been spawning, you can see. Nice, look at the belly on that thing. Nice big, healthy pike. Let her go. Not what we're after, but we'll take it. Thanks everyone for watching the very first FWF fishing video. I hope you enjoyed watching it as much as I did making it. If you did like it, like and subscribe. If you didn't like it, leave me a comment below. Let me know what I can do better. I'm back in the shop. I got some pike poppers to finish carving up. So I'll see you guys next time. Till then.